is going on guys? Thanks for tuning back here at JWTV and I'm sorry I haven't uploaded for a few days. The reason for that is there hasn't been no big transfer news in the papers and online. There has with the there has in such talks with the Lacazette joining Arsenal and Paul Pogba making a world record move back to Man United, but these deals haven't been finalised. And the reason why I haven't got videos out is because you guys come to me for all the uh, general footballing news, the transfer news, and just general breaking news. And if these deals aren't finalised, if I bring you a breaking news or a shocking transfer to say Pogba has joined Man United for a world record fee of 110 million euros, and a couple of days later it turns out that he's stayed at Juventus, I'm going to feel like a fraud because I haven't gave you guys sufficient content, and you guys aren't going to want to come to me anymore for the latest news because you'll think I'm a total bullshitter. So once the Lacazette deal is finalised, once the Paul Pogba deal is finalised and it's down, written in contracts, written on paper that they're joining them two teams, then I will get them for you. But today, our main focus is the is the move for the Frenchman, Kevin Gamiero, from Sevilla to Atletico Madrid. I do my research before I bring you guys the main bits, and as you know, We've stopped discussing the two positives and negatives for the teams, and we've just gone to the sole impact it will have on the player. Uh, my, as I said, guys, these are my opinions. You have yours, I have mine. But I think it's a great move for Gamiero and Atletico itself. He's seen the same league, so he still knows top football. He still knows how to play. He still can keep that goal scoring record. And he's going on to a bigger, better club in, in that Spanish league. If he probably went from Sevilla to Chelsea or to Arsenal, Liverpool, United, City, he's coming into a much faster league. He's coming into a much more difficult league. Probably many more teams titling for the title, competing for the title. Let's compare Premier League, Arsenal, Man City, Chelsea, United, Liverpool and maybe Spurs. They are probably the favourites for the title, whereas in the Spanish league, Barca, Real, Atletico. You could probably argue uh, maybe Sevilla or maybe Bilbao, etc. But the main ones are Barca, Real and Atletico. And the Premier League is a much entirely different ball game. So overall, I think Kevin Gamiero's choice to go to Atletico... Is a great decision. He's staying in the same league. As I said, he can get more goals. He, he knows how the league works. He knows the sort of play style it is. And he's going on to a bigger, better club, playing with probably bigger, better players. However, Sevilla have lost Gamiero, but they've gained Ben Yedda. And I think they've gained Luciano Vieto as well. I think he has gone from Atletico Madrid to Sevilla. So, make with that what you will. But today's focus is the Kevin Gamiero move. Now, let's get into the actual impact. Uh, as I said, I'll do my research. He scored about 36 goals in, 90, in about 90 games for Seville. That's a goal every three games, roughly. If you think he scores a goal every two games, that'll be 45 in 90. But he's scored about 30 in, in a 90, 36 in 90. So that's probably a goal every three games. That is a pretty good striker record. And it's like Higuain. He's got many informed cards on FIFA, which shows that he's been informed. He shows he's got talent. And he is a goal scorer. He, he is a good goal scorer. Not, not like Higuain. I mean, he's nowhere near like Higuain, but he's a goal scorer. And I think Atletico Madrid, after losing Luciano Vieto, I think they could do the goal scorer. And I think Gamiero, same league, same, same league, same position. I think he'll fit the deal just right. Which brings us on to the next things. Will he win any more honours at Atletico Madrid? I'm putting big money down to say he will. I've done my research. He's won the Europa League, I think, three times it is. As Seville, yeah, uh, when Seville played Liverpool. Yes, I am a Liverpool fan. Oh, well, when we went 1-0 up, I thought, come on. And then it, it turned down to... To, th to 3-1 in the end, with Kevin Gamiero equalising the score just 30 seconds into the second half. But, live and learn, eh? He won three successful Europa Leagues on the track with Sevilla, so he's won three Europa Leagues. He's won the League One in 2012-13 with PSG, I believe. So he's had his fair share of clubs. Sevilla, PSG, he's now at Atletico. And I think he'll win many more. 
I think he can uh, contend for the Champions League. He, c I think he could win the league. I, I think Atletico Madrid and Diego Simeone have the team to win the Spanish league. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Do you think he will win the league? Do you think Atletico Madrid and Diego Simeone have the team to win the league? And more cups, your uh, Europa, Champions, etc, etc. If ever Atletico Madrid don't make it into the Champions League, they've always got Europa, but they're a team that will probably make it. So let me know in the comments what honours you think Kevin Gamiero will win. Let me know over on Twitter. Go follow me on Twitter. Go follow me on Facebook. Go follow me on Instagram. All social media is at the end of this video and not in the description. So I'll tell you guys now, if ever none of you read the description, always go, even if you don't want to watch the video, just skip to the end, just go look at my social media, go give me a like or a follow on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. It's greatly appreciated, guys, to know I've got some followers and subscribers out there, so go to that. But anyway, back to my focus. Overall, I believe it's a great move for him. He's going on to a bigger, better club. I think he'll win a lot more runners, including the league, including the Champions League, depending on how long he stays. I think he'll get a lot more goals. I think he's playing with a better team. He's playing with a fantastic manager. He's playing with one of the best managers out there. And Atletico Madrid fell narrowly short of the Champions League last season to Real Madrid, obviously. But it's getting there. It, it, even if even if they do reach the final of the Champions League and Luis Gamero can say, I've made it to Champions League. I have got a loser medal, but I've made it. And now we can push on for bigger and better things. But yeah, overall, he's gone to a better club. I think he's going to get a lot more goals. I think he's going to win a lot more runners, including the Spanish Cup. Not the Champions League or anything, but the Spanish Cup. I'm not sure what it's called. If you guys know the name of the Spanish Cup, leave that in the comments down below. So, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Sorry I haven't uploaded for four days, as it says on, on my account. That's because there hasn't been no big transfer talks. I like to bring you these talks as they're done, contracted, on the paper. And if I bring you a, uh, a Pogba to United, and it turns out you want to start Juventus, you guys are going to think I'm a total bullshitter. I'm going to be a fraud. None of you want to kind of come to me. But if you have enjoyed these videos, let me know what other videos you want to see. When FIFA 17 comes out, I will be doing regular uploads on that, including the journey, road to glory, pack openings, etc, etc. So make sure you stay subscribed and tune in to see that. I haven't done FIFA at all recently due to my due to me ending my uh, public career mode and obviously due to the fact that FIFA 17 is out within a month. But once FIFA 17 is out, I'll be doing regular uploads on that. So if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like, please subscribe. It means the world to me. Go follow me on Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. That means the world. And until... Tomorrow, four days' time, a week's time. I will try and get it every day, guys. Until next time, see you later.